you can validate the data entered into a cell is a date or time and display an error message if invalid data is entered you can add data validation to either a single cell or for a range of cells the example worksheet first two columns if you want to allow entry of valid dates within a specific range only select all cells in first two columns click on data tab in data tools click on data validation data validation dialog box is displayed click on settings click on allow drop down list click on date now click on data drop down list you have several options like between not between equal to etc based on your selection excel changes the parameters it accepts for the validation for example if it is between it asks for start date and end date if it is equal to not equal to less than etc it asks for the date you want to compare for example select between now enter the start date as 0531 2017 and end date as 06 18 you can see the ignore blank check box if it is checked then excel allows to leave the cell as empty and doesn't validate it if you want to display an input message whenever a cell in this range is selected click on input message you can enter the title as valid dates in the input message enter 0531-2017 to 06-18-2017 if user enters a valid uh, date not in the range you can stop and display a hard error message to do this click on error alert enter title as invalid date in the error message enter valid dates are 0531-2017 to 06-18-2017 click ok you can see any cell selected in the range excel displays a input message valid dates are 0531 2017 2 06 18 try to enter an invalid date like 1 2 3 4 and hit enter you can see excel displays error alert message as you entered in the data validation excel will stop you until a valid date in the range is entered into the cell if you don't want to stop the user you can go back to error alert and make it as information only select the data range again go back to data validation instead of the stop click on the drop down list and click on information click okay now if you enter a invalid value excel only displays a information message but it still allows you to enter the invalid data but you can also disable disable the error alert so that excel won't show any message and allows to enter invalid dates if you want to do that go back to the data validation and uncheck the box where it says display error if invalid data is entered now you can enter valid dates invalid dates into the uh, two columns where the data validation is active excel allows you to enter any value but if you want to display the invalid dates with a uh, circle as error values then select the range of data again
now click on the circle invalid data then you can see excel circles the invalid data the time validation is similar to the date validation select the range of data where you want to do the time validation click on data validation under settings now click on time in the data drop down you have the same options uh, between less than or equal to greater than etc for example if you want to compare greater than 1 pm in the afternoon you can either enter the value as like uh, 13 0 0 0 0 or 0 1 0 0 0 0 pm now enter a time less than 0 1 0 0 pm you can see excel displays a default error message because no error alert message was set up error message is displayed any invalid time or any time less than 1 pm is entered into the cell there is one drawback with any of these excel data validations if user instead of entering a value copies the value from a different cell in the worksheet then data validation is not applied and excel copies the value even though it violates the data validation if you like this video please subscribe to our channel